Clinging tightly to his mommy and his favorite stuffed animal, little Adam is your typical 10-month-old. But he had a rough start in life. At just six weeks old, Adam's mom, Shanesty, shot this video because it looked like Adam was having trouble breathing. You could see his rib cage. He had a little bit of a V right here. He was really labored in his breathing, and he was vomiting after every feeding. Adam was diagnosed with RSV, a respiratory virus that can make it difficult for young babies to breathe. RSV alone is the single most common cause of hospitalization among children less than one year of age in the U.S. Last year we have 600 babies being hospitalized at Nationwide Children's alone with RSV and probably more than a thousand came to the emergency room. Dr. Octavio Ramilo says most babies with RSV recover without the need for hospitalization, but some develop severe symptoms that can become life-threatening. The first subtle thing is that they cannot take the bottle very well. But the second is the breathing is not very balanced. Parents and caregivers can reduce the risk of RSV by washing their hands, disinfecting hard surfaces, and avoiding sharing dishes and utensils. Very young babies should not be exposed to a lot of people. Their immune system, the white cells that protect us against infections, are not ready yet. Lots of babies don't survive. We were one of the lucky ones. Yay! Currently, many high-risk babies are given an injection of synthetic antibodies to help reduce the effects of RSV. But research is ongoing to develop a vaccine to prevent RSV on a global scale. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.